everyone and back with a new video. Um, to keep with the string of collection videos that I've been putting out, I decided to put out my sunglass collection video. I've been watching a lot of these recently and I've been really enjoying them. I'm an avid collector of sunglasses amongst many other things and so I thought I would share my collection with everyone here on YouTube as well. My favourite sunglass collection has probably been, um, what's her name? Claire? You know that Claire girl? She had like lots of Miu Miu sunglasses which I have now become obsessed with and have to have and I can't get anywhere. Oh well, I'll find them eventually. So I'm going to start off with my collection. I do have a fair few sunglasses. Um, I would say half a designer, half are just like from the local shop. I'm going to start with my Ray-Ban sunglasses. My first pair, I'm with this brown one like usual. Um, have your authenticity slip and sunglasses cleaner but I always seem to lose that. I apologize right now. Disclaimer. I do not clean my sunglasses that often. Oh, oh well. I wear them in the ocean, which you probably shouldn't. And yeah, oh well. I bought these all myself, by the way, if you're wondering. Um, these are my first ever pair of expensive sunglasses. Actually, my first pair of sunglasses I actually think I bought myself. They are the Wayfarer I don't know, normal ones. I think they're the 55 millimeter. 50 millimeter black. They look like that. Oh, they look. I love these sunglasses. Aren't they so hot? My sister Lauren actually bought them first and then hated them. And then she went to schoolies and I stole them and bought them off her. Well, I, I traded her a Naked 3 palette for it, so it's fine. And there they are. Um, I bought them from Sunglasses Hut in Hawaii. I think they're about $130. My next pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses are the same thing as the other ones, but I think like <laughs> they're not. These are the green um, aviators, gold. I thought the green would go beautiful with my red hair. They look like that. I bought them recently. I got them on special for 130 with the friends, family and friends discount from Macy's from the sunglasses hut. Gorgeous, love them. They're non polarized. Most of my sunglasses aren't polarized except for a Tommy Hilfiger pair I have. They look like that. Absolutely gorgeous. Love them to death. They look so good. At least I think they look good. I'm a huge fan of reflective colored sunglasses. Majority that I have are these ones. So there we go. My last pair of Ray Bans are again Wayfarers, and I think I just snapped that off. That annoys me. I went back in because this is so annoying. Look at that. Broke. I hate that. But I asked them to get a new one. They're like, oh, sorry, we can't. Oh, okay. Whatever. <laughs> that really annoys me. I don't know why. Um, they are the Tortoiseshell Wayfarer, new Wayfarer, 55mm. They look like this. They're my second pair of glasses that I bought myself. I love them. They're gorgeous. Classic. I wear them all the time. I wear them in the water. They're awesome. I think they cost me a hundred lies. I bought these, um, a Tommy Hilfiger and a um, Steve Madden pair. I got them all for like 200 on a sale. Yeah. The next pair I'm going to pick up are my Celine ones. I bought these recently from Nordstrom Rack. They come in the, you know, Celine pouch. They come in a cardboard little envelope too, but whatever. And they are these pair here. They are dirty. They're dirty. They look like that. Um, the CL. 53 millimeter, Celine made in Italy. They look like this. But they were like such a classic pair of sunglasses. Like, I feel like I'm a movie star when I wear them. Hang on, put this out. Don't you think? Yeah. Anyway, they're those ones there. They cost me a um, hundred and something from Nordstrom Mac US dollars. Oh well. I like them. Nicole Greer did her sunglasses video and she had this Celine ones and I was like I need to get a pair and then they're on special so I bought them so that is that the next pair I'm gonna pick up is some key eyewear um by the way if you're wondering why it's not like that it's like circular key I realized that the other day not sure if anyone else did um my first pair of ones I bought off of uh, the iconic here in Australia they cost me about $19 on special from 50 they're the Ziggy 7.2 they look like this. They have the purple pink one. If you watch my Hawaii vlog, I'm wearing them. They are crazy. I feel like Lady Gaga loves it. Super cheap, super pretty. Everyone always stares, but I feel like I'm a drug queen. Hello, awesome. The next pair I recently picked up from Trade Secret, 
And you want to see what happened to him? Had him two days. No. Yeah, that's not trendy. It's not cool. Try to fix them. It's like a pirate. It looks like I'm going to a 3D video movie and I pop one lens out. They were $16.95 on special. I'm going to try and fix them. I still have the other thingy. My dad might be able to fix them. If not, I'll just chuck them out. I bought my sisters a few pairs too because there was like a couple for $16.95 and my pair happened to break. Oh well. The next pair I have in front of me is uh, my Steve Madden. These are just aviators. Plain ones. They've got like the brown lenses, gold, tortoiseshell, they're like a full diamante. They're about, whoa, they're wonky. There we go. Yeah. My $55 I think about and I got them on special further. I love them. They were from Macy's. Um, doesn't say anything about what they are. Oh, they're polarized and they're gold. That's it. Bought them a few years ago. My next two pair of sunglasses are in my forever new cases. I love these cases and I always get them on special for like three bucks. Love it. Um, the first pair I pick up is a cheap pair. Okay. These are just from I think um, Charlotte Russe. They're like my ones I had before, but they cost me like $3 from Charlotte Russe. I have so many pairs of these because I just chuck them in all my handbags and I love them. I feel like Kylie Jenner, even though I look nothing like her, but you know what I'm talking about. So cute, so lovely. I think I'm totally out of focus. Hello. I think I was out of focus for all of that. Anyway, here they are. They look like that. Like my Steve Madden ones, but they were cheap from Charlotte Roos. I think they're about three dollars. My next pair, oh, are my Tommy Hill figures. I lost the case for these. Anyway, these are just Cat Eye Tommy Hill figures. It says THDL 72, 61 millimeter. If it means anything to you, they are black. They are Cat Eye. I feel like um, Karen off of Will and Grace for these ones. So gorgeous. Love them. Cost me like seventy dollars. So beautiful. The next sunglasses I have are all smashed in this sunglasses holder I have. I need to get another one, but oh well. Okay, so the first one I'm going to start off is with my blue mirrored aviators that I have. These ones were from BW. They look like that. They're a bit wonky. I smashed them around in my handbag because the nose needs to be fixed. They're like $20 oversized blue aviators with like this gold hardware. Loves it. The next pair I have are from Charlotte Russe. I have lots of Charlotte Russe ones, by the way. And they are these beautiful green to blue ones. Silver hardware aviators. Love them. They were all like $8. Next one I gave from Charlotte Russe. Light blue. Silver hardware. Apologize. You see they're filthy. Beautiful. Love them. Then I have these ones that I think are from uh, like Ruby Shoes or Cockmom. They're just big tortoiseshell oversized ones. Just ones that all these ones that I can chuck around when I go on the water because I am a water baby. And these ones are like $5 on a clearance rack. The next ones I have are from Big W again. They have a decent little sunglasses rack if you're from the cosmetics section. They remind me of ones that what's her Nicole Nicole from Jersey Shore Wall. They have the bead of bling. They look like that. Aviators, I love them. I just think they suit my face shape. Um, next ones I have are these oversized cat ones. These are from Cotton On. They look like this. They're like the they got ombre, black to white. I was really loving that ombre thing. Look like that. Going about five dollars. Oh, another pair of blue aviators. Sorry, hanging back. They look like that. Let's see. Seven dollars. Another pair that with rose gold hardware. Going for like seven dollars. Then I have an oversized Prada esque pair. See that? These are from Ruby Shoe. They're like four dollars. Tortoise shell. Love tortoise shell with my red hair. Then I have this. Remind me of Fendi with the Lions Black Pair from Ruby Shoe. Beautiful, love them, like $5. Then this small pair from Typo. They were so different and cute. They look like that, they were like $5. Then I 
Then I have like Top Gun, um, like the black or the silver reflective aviators, a bunch of these. All from Charlotte Russe or from like Cotton On. I literally have like four pairs of the exact same thing. See? Yeah. I love them. They look like that. They're the smaller size. Silver hardware. I love them. And yeah, that uh, concludes all of my sunglasses for my sunglasses collection. I hope you've enjoyed this video as I really enjoy watching these. I am a huge fan of sunglasses. If I don't wear makeup out of a day, I will just chuck giant sunglasses on and be on my merry way. Giant sunglasses, oversized tote, and you are ready to face the world every single day on top. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I hope you're enjoying seeing more videos from all of us. Lauren will have some up soon, and I will see you later. Bye!